Hi, I'm Kelly Lambert, and I'm here at the University of Richmond, and this is my behavioral neuroscience laboratory. And we have a rat here driving a car, and um, so this has really wowed our world lately. You heard the story about the driving rats, um, but I wanted to just show you a real rat uh, driving a car. And now we'll go, um, <laughs> Olivia's going to get the car now. Uh, but I wanted to tell you a little bit more about the research that we're doing in the laboratory. <laughs> Um, so, rats have brains that are similar to our brains. They're just really tiny compared to our um, human brains, but they have all the same parts and all the same neurochemicals. So we're interested in how enriched environments, living in kind of a Disneyland with things to do, sculpts and changes the brain and makes the animal smart so that they can drive and steer the car like you just saw. Um, and it reminds us that it's important for, for us to spend time in, in engaging in tasks like building things and being outside, that it's changing our brains. It also changes our neurochemistry, not only our anatomy of the brain, uh, so stress hormones that sometimes make us feel bad can be reduced as we build something and we build up our confidence and we feel good about that. So we use these rats uh, to learn more about ourselves. So we've learned a lot from the rats and from their brains, and it reminds us to take really good care of our own brains. Thanks.